Hello everyone. So in this video, we will discuss that how we can check the viability of cells means whether the cells they are living or dead. It means viability. So how we can check that the cells are viable or dead. So without any delay, uh, let's start the video. So in order to check the viability of cells, we generally perform certain staining methods which include like first is the fluorescein diacetate staining method. In this we use a dye that is FDA dye fluorescein diacetate. Here this FDA dye it stain the living cells as yellow green within the 5 minute of staining. So by using this dye the living cells they will be stained yellow and the dead cell they will remain unstained. Second method is tetrazoleum chloride staining method. Here we use the dye that is tetrazoleum chloride. This dye it stain the living cell and converted them as red formazone and it also show the respiration of cells. So by this method we can also find out the living cells. Next Evans blue. Here this Evans blue this dye it stain the dead cells. It enter inside the dead cells and stain them as blue in color. We generally use 0.025% of this Evans blue. So all the dead cells they will take up this stain while the living cells or viable cells they remain unstained. Next method of viability is phenosephronine method. Here this phenosephronine it again it stain the dead cells. Means this dye is specific for dead cells and the dead cells they turned red with phenosephronine. The viable cells or the living cells they remain unstained by the phenosephronine. So by using this phenosephronine we can also find out by, about the living or dead cells. The next is calcofluor white staining method. Here the calcofluor white it can ascertain the viability of cells by detecting the cell wall formation. Means if there is a formation of new cell wall then it will turn white due to this calcofluor white. So only the living cell has the capability to grow its cell wall. So we can say that if the cell wall formation there then it means this cell or that particular cell is viable in state or living in state that's why he that's why it is making its a new cell wall. So the formation of new cell wall is detected by the calcofluor white staining method. And oxygen uptake, simply as we respire we take the oxygen so the cells either the plant cells or animal cells they also take the oxygen. So we can carefully measure the uptake of oxygen by using some elect oxygen electrodes. So if there is uptake of oxygen so we can say the cells are viable or living that's why they are taking up the oxygen dead cell they do not consume any oxygen. So these are the some methods by which we can check the viability of plant cells or any viable cells. We can differentiate between the viable cells and the dead cells. So this is all about that how we can check the viability of cells. So that's all for today guys. See you in the next video. Thank you very much.